Now to some dire environmental news. Today, NOAA released a report finding that U.S. coastlines will experience a profound sea level rise by 2050. This comes just one day after another report was published finding that the southwest United States is now experiencing the driest conditions in more than a thousand years. We take a look by the numbers. Scientists now predict that sea levels surrounding the U.S. will rise an additional 10 to 12 inches by 2050. That's a century's worth of sea level rise in less than 30 years, according to NOAA. Rising sea levels will intensify storm surges, high tides, coastal erosion, and wetland loss. The report reads, quote, by 2050, moderate flooding, which is typically disruptive and damaging by today's weather, sea level, and infrastructure standards, is expected to occur more than 10 times as often as it does today. Also this week, a study published in Nature Climate Change found that two decades of drought in the Southwest has created the driest conditions in more than 1,200 years. The study analyzed tree ring patterns, which gives us insight about soil moisture. Since the year 2000, the average soil moisture deficit has been two times as severe as any drought of the 1900s. And human-caused climate change, the study says, is responsible for about 42% of that soil moisture deficit over the past two decades. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.